everyone, welcome back to another episode of DNA Tasters, and we have mood. Yay! <laughs> so today we're trying out food in our new areas. Yeah. Yep. And this is the hamburger. The hamburger, not hamburger. Yeah, it's different. Yeah, here's the sign. The hamburger. It's rumored that they are nice, right? Yeah. This used to be an Orchard and like Somerset area but I think they closed down mm. for quite a while so I don't know maybe during Covid I haven't really seen them but I remember hearing a lot of nice things about their food mm. so we are trying it today Yes and we realised that in our area they got kind of like a shed kitchen with soup spoon Oh, maybe so who bought them? We also don't know. We no idea. We no idea. <laughs> Not much info on Google, right? About that. No. No. Yeah. Yeah. So without much further ado, we're going to try it out. I bought the original hamburger. Yeah. It comes with the standard BLT, you know, with the beef patty, tomatoes, and cheese. Yep. Yeah. I think it should be that one over there. And honey, you bought the. Oh, I just ordered the double cheese Burger? Yeah, obviously Okay, and it actually has a set So if you order it, you can either choose fries Mushroom soup Or Caesar salad Yeah Am I right? I think so Yep, and you can choose the drinks offered by Soup Spoon as well Things like, you know, hibiscus tea Cloudy apple. apple juice, orange juice, and of course the standard lemon tea. Yeah. All right. Without much further ado, let us try. I need to understand with your burger first. Not really, but okay. Why not really? Yeah. Lazy. Oh, lazy. See? Yeah. Oh, he's lazy. Ooh, very really saucy. You might want to get a plate. Okay. It's like super duper saucy. Mm. Yeah, our plates. Let's see. Ooh, wait, I think the box. Uh. Yeah, it is super saucy. Bun nicely toasted. Mm. It's a brioche bun, right? I did not read the. Yeah, the description says a brioche bun. The bun is nicely toasted. It's quite flavorful. Mm. The pieces of beef that I took is nicely charred. Um, very beefy. Ooh, it's like spilling everywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The only thing I think is a bit too saucy. Um, I guess but it's better to be a bit too saucy than under saucy. Mm. Yeah, so. Are there any other condiments in your order? Yeah, mine has cheese, grilled onions. My bed, my bite was too shallow, so I didn't really get the grilled onions. And some kind of Thousand Island dressing as well, yeah. right? Thousand Island sauce makes it a bit saucy. Yeah, uh, this is a very messy eat, I realize. So, I know some of our viewers don't like to see this, but I think we have no choice. Because it's a very messy burger. We'll be needing this tissue. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So, yeah. It's not bad. It's better than some of the burgers that we've tried. But whoa, you see, it's very slimy, very sticky, and everything comes like coming out. I guess you no. Know, perhaps it can be called sloppy joes. <laughs> no, mine is very mine is very messy. Like yours, you can try yours first. Though. Okay. I think I know why they really, they give this aluminium uh, point. Yeah, is to keep the burger in check. 
They don't know burgers need to be kept in check, but hey, now you know. I shall try their original burger. Hopefully, it's less saucy. Yep, mine is a little less. I'm going to set it to one side. Here we go. Itadakimasu. I would say the burger, my burger is a bit overcooked, like it's not medium, but it's quite well done. Yeah. Here goes nothing. Mm. My mouth is too small for my burger. Vegetables are a bit bitter. They could be the uh, arugula, what do you call it? Arugula. 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 Ar but my uh, meat is a bit on the dry side. Mm -hmm. mm. It's like it's not moist in the center. Or maybe because I'm at the edge. Yeah. Speak of the devil. I thought it was like not saucy. They're like, eeeeh. I got an accident. It's not bad. I would say it's not bad. I like the bun. They really toast it well. Even though it's got the burger is quite saucy, the bun is not soaked in wet. Mm. That's one thing I like. Mm. Um, the beef could be a little less uh, overcooked. Uh. Mm. It was quite dry. But it's seasoned well. Mm. Yeah, not bad. Uh, the salt and pepper is seasoned quite well. Mm. Especially I think it's mine has the pepper the pepper taste of mine is quite strong so. So I think we all just that's about are we going to Are we going to try the salad first? No, okay. and I think this is a bit of a messy eat. Yeah. You know, everybody I think I know why is it like that. Because everybody you think, right? The sauce actually oozes out from both sides, mm -hmm. where the aluminium foil is not covering it. But yeah. when you if you bite without the aluminium foil, right? It it's just worse. Out. Yeah. So it's worse. And so maybe they made one to copy like normal or burger king or wrap that thing in like paper. Yeah, mm -hmm. maybe maybe that will help better. Either way, let me try the salad. This is just supposed to be a standard scissor salad. salad. Yeah. So. I hope um, it tastes good. It should be the standard soup spoon Caesar salad. But it comes with condiment? That should be the Caesar salad, the Caesar sauce. Uh. Okay. Mmm, there's anchovies, I guess. Yeah, Caesar salad sauce. It comes with croutons as well. This one should be dried anchovies on the top. No, some dried tomatoes. You want me to douse it in sauce? Just pour it on. Mm. All of my pickles fell off. Right in the back. Mm -hmm. I'm going to. I doubt I can to toss, 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 toss it. I'm going to seal this so small. Mm. Pretty standard. I like that it has like the sun dried tomatoes in it, which not a lot of people give. Maybe you can add a bit more parmesan. Maybe that'll be nicer. Mm -hmm. Want to try? Uh, give me a second. Let me wash my hands. They're very oily. Uh, let me try this.
Desert. Where is Desert? Um, at least you don't taste the chemicals of the veggie. <laughs> and there are a lot of places there. Yeah, the pesticide, not, yeah, the yeah, more pesticide. It's not clean properly. It's not clean properly. Nothing much to comment, I feel, for the salad. Now, it's... Yeah. Uh-huh. The... Yeah, like you said, you could use more cheese, but... Uh. The... Other than that, the croutons are not really... Very uh, crispy. Mm. Might be condensation. Could be. Yeah, because we, we grab food it anyway. <sighs> okay, so... What is the price price point for this? I think my meal was at sixteen odd seventeen dollars. Okay, so this is the meal. So Mine is a a la carte burger. That was at eight eight ninety. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. So as the meal for the meal itself, I would say at that price point, uh, it's is a very possible. Uh, because if you just say you're eating this outside in the shop and it's this saucy, you will create a mess. Mm. I won't bring people to eat this for the first day. No. It's, it's a not, bad choice. It's not. Even like, uh, it can't make you want to eat the burger with a fork knife. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that also I was contemplating actually. I was thinking, should I just go get my knife and, you know, and get all the way because it's it. yeah it doesn't really feel like it, it's too it's too messy and saucy to be uh, mm. like as a burger so that like you look at this of McDonald's or Burger King they're not as saucy the only one that sauciness reminds me of is like Ramly burger but that is like enclosed yeah it has its own like wrap paper wrap yeah so it's not too bad it's still quite Messy and like the sauce gets everywhere. Mm -hmm. Oh well, so you can't even do the you know the you know they say you have to hold three fingers up and two fingers down when you hold a burger. That's mm. supposedly the right grip. I can't even do that for this one. Yeah, it's slippery. It is too um, slippery. It's the, so, it's like really sloppy joes. Yeah. Yeah. If in terms of uh, flavor, uh, you know it's six. The burger a bit dry. The Sauteed onions are a bit sweet. The pickle doesn't taste like a pickle. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, the pickle has no like the it tastes like the brine beef sauce or something. It doesn't taste like a pickle. Shall we swap? Let's try each other's burger. Is you sure? Yeah. Mine is like oh my gosh. You already at six. I read before you eat. I I rate mine like maybe a five five and a half. I would have given it higher if, if, if the meat wasn't so dry. Yeah. As in yeah. like, it kind of makes me feel like they are trying to make up for the dry meat with the sauce. Yeah. And that's not the way to do yeah, it. That's not the way to do it. You, you eat it, you know it's dry, you know. Mm. There's no hiding it. Yeah. yeah. So, we're going to try each other's burgers and we will rate each other's burgers. Yeah. Oh, yours doesn't have a thousand island sauce. Mine... I have, have, have. Hey, no, yours have, mine don't have. Mine doesn't taste a thousand island. Oh? Yeah. Tastes like something else. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna stab his burger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I kind of given up, like looking at the condition of it. Like ah, never mind. I should just stab it. Ah. Go eat the bread and the meat and the pickle. Hmm. Hmm. Your burger is so much easier to eat than mine. <laughs> but it's yeah, I can tell. Yours is still dry. The 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 patty is dry. It's definitely overcooked. Yours is sweet for some reason. That is the. Onion, the salted onions. The pickle did nothing to the sweetness. 
Yeah, I told you the the, the, the pickle is there for sure. Not, not, not it's not a pickle. You don't taste the pickle. You don't taste it at all. Maybe yeah. good for people who don't like pickles, uh, since you can't answer like the pickle, right? <laughs> but still, it's like it that because it doesn't contrast it. There's no balance. So yeah. It's too like overly sweet. I feel, feel like eating a brulee burger. Almost. Not about mine. This is actually very normal. Yours is like the safe option. <laughs> just mine is just like a bit like some parts are like nice, some parts are like eh? I don't know what to feel about this flavor. No, I rate it a five. It's edible but so sweet that it's getting very old. The taste is like you no know you get taste patty. Yeah. If I have a double bur- burger double patty burger. With this kind of flavor, I can't even get through half the I get taste pretty half the Singaporeans call it jelat. You actually you eat it without the uh, the onions itself, right? It's actually pretty okay. The onions are overly sweet. I think they added too much. Um, they put too much sugar for the caramelization. Yeah. It's overly sweet. There's no contrast. There's no taste of onion. It's just overly sweet. Sweet. It's like almost like they do a French onion soup, then mm. take out the onion and put it on your burger. Wow. How would you rate my burger? I prefer your burger over mine. Me too. <laughs> because one is you have at least veggie inside. You know, that is you know, contrasting. So yours is a very balanced one. Mm. Mine is an overly sweet one. And like the pickles do nothing to help <laughs> the flavor. How will you rate mine? I would say yours is like five point five, just like slightly better than mine. Uh, it's no shake shake, it's no, no five guys. No. Um, We're not expecting it to be. It'll be a wow, if it is. Yeah, yeah. It's, not even, it's not even like uh, but the ash and burn it, the one. Ah, uh, yeah, ash burn it was good, cool. yeah. Like, even if you compare to those, it's okay. Like, that reminds me of an expensive pasta burger. Ah, yeah. Like, Rami burger, but Rami burger went wrong. Yeah. I think you should eat some of the salad to contrast that. <laughs> With my help. I will eat the salad after. Okay, okay. Again, I can use it to cleanse my palate. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. I think the the drink we only go through like, is the standard uh no. uh ice lemon tea for me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay la. So that comes to the end of our first uh-huh. I just realized there's cheese in this, I couldn't even really taste the cheese. I even the motori jack, right? You can't even taste it. Yeah. Yeah. Like looking at it right, I thought it was just like some sort of sauce, but actually it's the cheese, but now yeah, eating it, it's so saucy and so sweet, you can't taste the cheese. The cheese did nothing too. It's uh, not even salty enough to overpower the uh, sweetness of it. Well, yeah, so, so I think that's the that's, end of our review for these burgers. <laughs> we will so, continue eating our dinner, and this is our first DNI tasters review in our new place. Yeah! yeah. To more reviews to come, yay! I'm not chasing my burger. <laughs> <laughs> okay, catch you guys up next time. Bye bye.